What's up guys, it's Charles here to do another unboxing. Um, so the purpose of these unboxings, obviously this is going to be for a motor. Uh, generally you would like to see the motor performing. Uh, but what I'm going to start trying to do is uh, just do the unboxings, just to show you the um, product up close, just to see how the presentation is, how the quality is uh, in hand, and then be able to show you how it performs later on. Uh, you know, take you step by step, uh, you know, with what you would normally encounter in real life if you were to buy this. But anyway, here is the uh, package here for the Leopard brushless motor. This is the LBWR 3650 9.5 turn. It's a two-pole brushless motor. Um, and it comes in this. It looks like a little deodorant can, but it's uh, actually a motor. So we're going to go ahead pop this plastic off right here. All right, then we're going to pop the cap off. It looks like you get a little baggie here. Let's see if we can open this up. Uh, with the instructions, I don't know why the instructions need to be in a baggie, but they are. You also get the sensor wire, which is kind of short. I don't think this is going to fit my application, but we'll worry about that later. And then, of course, the actual motor here, which uh, upon you know first inspection here looks to be pretty good finish. Uh, very nicely anodized here in red. Uh, the end caps are also, I guess they're plastic but they almost look like anodized metal. As a matter of fact, the end caps are metal, all right? And then you obviously got the little uh, soldering spots here for the wires. They're clearly labeled. Here, nice uh, little tampo printing of the logo. So very good so far, feels nice, nice heft. The only thing I'm a little worried about is just the holes here. I kind of wanted to get a sealed motor, but this uh, fit the application that I wanted it for uh, more than the other ones I was looking at. And the price was right. Uh, more than anything, uh, you know, I'm going to have to stay away from as much water as I can because it is a censored motor. I don't want anything getting screwy, but uh, definitely good for what I'm using it for, which is actually for a uh, Arma Fury uh, BLX, which I bought um, as a roller. So I have the regular Mega with the brushed motor, but I want to step up to brushless. So I bought a rolling chassis, um, which I put together, put the tranny, put wheels and everything. Now I'm ready to, you know, get the electronics done. Uh, but anyway, here looks like it's got a little warranty card. All right, so you can actually scan it and I guess register your product, and uh, it tells you how to do that right here. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I don't think it even comes with wires. I pull this out. It doesn't seem to have anything else in there. So I'm gonna have to get wires for this, I guess. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. If you have any questions or comments, leave them below and I'll try and do an updated video as soon as I can with this motor installed.